Hey everybody, this is my video this week for everything that I got at CVS. It's spread out here in my different transactions. Um, and this is everything that I got. I will go ahead and start here. Um, this week, 515 through 521, and I started with 14 ECBs. This is the front page of the ad. Um, my first transaction is part of this deal to spend 30 and get 10. And these are the items I picked up. One Cottonelle toilet paper, two Scott paper towel, a um, Cottonelle uh, wet wipes, um, Persil laundry soap, and then a palm olive oxy um, dish soap. So, the palm olive is 98 cents. We have a 25 cent coupon in the 515 Smart Source. Two Scott paper towels. They are on sale for 549. There is a dollar off coupon in the 515 Smart Source as well. I think they're all for the 515 Smart Source. Yep. Cottonelle toilet paper is 9.99 with the 50 cent coupon. Cottonelle wipes 3.99 with a 50 cent coupon. And the Priscilla Laundry is $4.34 with a dollar off coupon, all from the $5.15 Smart Source. Now, I wasn't going to do this deal, and then um, I checked my CVS app on Sunday, and I had received a $6 off of a $30 purchase. So I figured, what better way than to use it here? I also used $10 in ECBs, and after all coupons and the $6 off and the $10 in ECBs, I paid $10.86 out of pocket and received a $10 ECB. So with receiving the $10 ECB after paying $10, it's really like I got all of this for 86 cents, which is great. Okay, so this right here is my second transaction. One Colgate Total Toothpaste, two um, NYX Lip Glosses, and one Physician's Formula Blush. Uh, the Colgate this week is $3, and with the Red Machine, you get a $2.50 instant coupon. Um, there is a $0.50 cent coupon in the newspapers. However, I used a $1 manufacturer coupon from coupons.com, which makes this a $0.50 cent money maker. Uh, so you do have to purchase other items in order to soak up that overage because you cannot get cash back at CVS um, when using coupons. So that's why I have the uh, lip gloss and the physician's formula here. I um, have a $3 off of a $15 cosmetic purchase. So I put that here. Uh, the lip glosses were 20% off at CVS this week. So one was $3.74 and one was $4.86. I had a dollar off of each coupons from the $5.15 Red Plum. And the physician's formula is 40% off, so it was um, $7.37. And I had the $2 off um, physician's formula app coupon that I forgot to write down here. Um, so I did have the $2 off of that, so I really paid $5.37 for this. And altogether, I paid $9.07 out of pocket which is great because the Physician's Formula Blush originally was a $12 item. So for less than the cost of the blush originally, I picked up all of these items here. And I went ahead and did the cosmetic purchase because I was so close to getting to my $50 in order to get the $5 back for Beauty Bucks. So I will have a $5 um, Beauty Buck on my card next week from this purchase here. Okay, for my third transaction, it was for the um, Playtex Sport tampons, as well as uh, two Pepsis. Now, my store was out of the 1.25 and 1.5 liters, so I went ahead and just grabbed two of the 20-ounce bottles, and they gave me the $2 off of those. Now, they did not come out free, but I was okay with um, paying $2 for two of them, made them a dollar a piece. Um, the Playtex tampons are on sale for $7.99. You get a $3 extra buck back when you purchase one limit of one. There was a $2 off um, coupon from coupons.com that I had printed. I used my $4 in ECBs that I had left from starting the week. And I paid $4.19 out of pocket and received a $3 extra buck. 
So it's like I paid after the extra buck, it's like a dollar nineteen for a box of tampons. So that is a win in my book. Okay, this is what I did for my fourth transaction. Gonna be two Nivea and one Dove. The Nivea this week is a buy one, get one free. They are five ninety nine a piece. There are $3 off of two coupons on coupons.com, and you can use coupons on a free item. So it does apply the $3 off of two, even though one is free. So it's like getting two Nivea body washes for $2.99, which is a great deal. Now I had a $4 off of a $14 body wash purchase from my uh, CVS personalized coupons. So... I could have done six Nivea body washes and then the three times it would be like $18 and then, you know, the corresponding coupons, but we love this Dove Gentle Exfoliating and I only had one and it's about halfway gone, so I wanted to get another one. They are $8.49. There's a $1.50 off manufacturer coupon and the 5-1 Smart Source. So I went ahead and picked that one up. So the $8.49 plus the $5.99, I reached my $14. So after coupons, I used the $3 extra buck that I got from the tampon transaction, and I paid $3.23 out of pocket for these. Okay, for my fifth and final transaction, I did another Colgate deal where you get the $2.50 instant coupon and then the dollar coupon from coupons.com, and I used the Wet n Wild nail polishes as a filler. Um, I did use a second card for this, um, and I only used the second card this time because I wanted the free toothpaste twice. So, Colgate toothpaste, $3.99, $2.50 off, dollar off, it's 50 cent money maker. The three Wet n Wilds are 99 cents a piece. They're buy two, get one free. There's 50 cent manufacturer coupons in the 58 Smart Source. Now, I only used two coupons. You can use three coupons because you can use a coupon on a free item. However, I only bought two newspapers that week, so I only had two coupons. But I did notice on my receipt, and I'll pull it out here. Okay, go ahead and do that. Here. You can see the Colgate, Wet n Wild, Wet n Wild, free, and then 250 cent off coupons, the 250 off Colgate. And then there's two dollar off coupon scanned. I believe the cashier rang up my dollar off from coupons.com twice. I did not know that or I would have said something. <clears throat> so then the 250 off Colgate didn't even take 250 off because he had sent the extra dollar. Um, I should have paid like 50 cents here, but it zeroed itself out because he scanned my coupon twice. So I did get these four items here for free completely. Okay, that is everything that I got this week. So here it is all put together. Um, my total out of pocket, I spent $27.35 of my own money. And it was over, it was $119 in products. So I saved 77%, which is great. I'd say anything over 75% savings is pretty darn good. So we are stocked up on paper towels again. I still have one of these left from the last time that I got paper towels. So they do last a long time here. All right, and Hope you guys enjoy this video. I hope it helps. Um, I guess it just shows that not every couponer here has, you know, such low out of pockets. I did spend twenty-seven thirty-five this week, but I went in not anticipating to spend this ten dollars and eighty-six cents. I was going to just use my ACBs and kind of roll things. Um, but yeah, all right. And thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe if you're not already subscribed. And I will see you guys in my next video.